The attempt to defame the character of Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, for his marriage of Aisha, may Allah be pleased with her, at a young age, fell flat. Like other, the controversy regarding the age of Aisha is a recent phenomenon, one that people have never had an issue with in the past, and during the lifetime of Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, his enemies would attack his character by calling him a sorcerer, a madman, a magician, a soothsayer, and much more. But they never mentioned the fact that why didn't his enemies lodge a fact that would assist them in defaming and attacking the character of Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, because the age of Aisha, may Allah be pleased with her, at that time and place was deemed acceptable, and the norm, Muslim historians who reported the story of Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him's marriage to Aisha, may Allah be pleased with her, never felt that Aisha, may Allah be pleased with her, had been engaged to someone else before Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, which tells us that she was old enough for marriage at that time and place. Taking our current day 21st century cultural norms and projecting them onto the auspices of 7th century Arabian society is not fair. In fact, it is considered a fallacy of presentism. One should not judge a person who lived more than 1400 years ago by today's standards, especially when doing something acceptable. And note, each society has its own set of norms.